How's it going? Back to another video here. This is going to be a short one. I only found uh, one item today. It was at an estate sale. I ended up paying uh, five dollars for this bag of watches here. Uh, it was mixed in with a lot of costume jewelry. A lot of times that's what happens. Uh, they throw bags like this mixed in with bags of costume jewelry. Uh, I saw this watch in here and I looked at it real quick and I thought it was a Hamilton. So uh, being a Hamilton, even if it didn't, if it did not work, uh, gold filled Hamilton was well worth five dollars. I saw there was a, a men's Timex uh, digital in here, so for five dollars, I grabbed it, uh, not realizing what was actually in here. So it was a pleasant surprise. Try and do this with one hand again. I'm going to go ahead and uh, pause the video to open this up. So open opened the bag up. I uh, just had the four watches in there. Uh, I got home and I put a battery in this to see if it worked. Uh, it does work, but uh, unfortunately, you can't set the time. So I'm not exactly sure what's going on with it. The light does work, uh, but uh, you can't set anything. So uh, that was in there. And then just a couple of ladies' watches. And then upon a closer inspection, I uh, realized this was not a Hamilton, but a Hampton. And uh, I thought it was gold filled. And upon closer inspection, uh, again, let me uh, pause the video here and I'll uh, turn this back around. I'll have to use two hands. So I turned the uh, back around again, like I thought it was a Hampton. I didn't realize uh, they made uh, uh, gold cases for these. And uh, sure enough, upon uh, closer inspection, it's a solid uh, 14 karat gold case here. So the band is uh, gold filled, but the uh, watch case is gonna be a uh, 14 karat gold. Not a very large watch, uh, but still a uh, 14 karat gold watch uh, for $5. So these deals still are out there. Again, this was a professionally run estate sale and they still do stuff like this. Uh, thanks for watching. And I'll see you next time.